Hello, I am Ice Beast, and welcome back to Battlefleet Gothic. We have finished all our deployments for uh, this turn. We have made allies, hopefully, and we're going to move on to the next uh, turn where we should get a cutscene because we seem to get one, or at least a conversation at the beginning of every turn. Admiral Spire, Eldrathane, your assistance dealing with the orcs has not been forgotten. Allow me to repay you by sharing some important and potentially dangerous information. I travel with a Farseer, one of my people who can read the weaves of fate. Her powers have revealed a traitor amongst your Imperial Navy, a captain named Elias Okar. He will betray you soon, during a major battle. If he is not dealt with, his actions may give Abaddon a decisive victory in this war. Why should I trust this vision of the future from a Xenos witch? This man may be a loyal servant of the Emperor. Any who wear the uniform of the Imperial Navy are worthy of it. Heed me, human. That which you call chaos can corrupt even the brightest spirit. I give you this knowledge only because the great enemy threatens us both. Consider it an act of good faith. I will need to consult with the Sector High Strategic Council. Do as you must, human. I am leading my ships to remove this traitor at once. You can either help excise this cancer from your midst or stand in my way. The choice is yours. Lord Admiral, Inquisitor, do you believe that the alien is correct? We have only his word to go on. Captain Elias Okar is a reliable man. He has always fought the enemies of the Emperor. I have heard certain rumors about Captain Okar. He has been far more distant with his crew since the beginning of the war. It seems we must rely on your instincts, Admiral Spire. So I'm going to accept because I like my alliance that I've built and I think we can keep it going. We must confront Captain Oak. I am pleased. I will order my fleet to I'm skipping the uh we're we're going to meet here. He basically said uh I want to talk to him before we kill him. Uh, you know, or at least I can try to talk to him out before we kill him. Now, before we launch the actual assault, I do have a few upgrades that I can make. I have about a thousand points, and my Emperor ship is ready for an, an upgrade. I think I'm going to get the, uh, the Advanced Cogitator's Last Longer ability, uh, even though i got to remember to use them, and I'm also going to totally get these Servitors. So let's go back to the Gothic Sector now, and we're going to launch our assault. We'll see how many points we get, and then that will be, uh, Allow me to decide what the heck I'm going to do. Ships are en route to the last known position okay, shut of up. Captain Okar. I, I don't... He basically says, let's kill him, but I'll, I'll let you try to negotiate first. Uh, I get 350 points. That's not enough. Like, I can only... If I do that, this is all I get to bring. And some line ships. I can get basically two line ships and, uh, and my battle battleship. Or I could bring in... A battle cruiser and a, and a regular cruiser. I think this makes the most sense. So Admiral we're gonna Spire do that. To Captain Elias Okar, respond, sir. Captain Okar reporting. You should know an Eldar battle group has been sighted in the area, and my crew is on maximum alert. Lord Admiral Ravensburg and Inquisitor Horst have approved a truce with the Eldar. All Imperial Navy vessels have strict orders not to engage the aliens. Sir, those orders are a disgrace. The Eldar have raided multiple Imperial convoys crossing this area over the last few weeks. These aliens are as much a threat as the Chaos fleets. The orders stand, Captain. Now heave to, power down your weapons, and prepare to be boarded. The Imperial Navy has grown weak. I will never surrender to Xenos. Alright, so I positioned my ship on the Captain, far side here. For my group. What will you do now, human? Negotiations are over. Captain Okar has sealed his fate. So I have... The reason I am on the far side is the same. This is basically a cruiser clash, and Understood. so I'm going to treat it as a cruiser clash. Um, At your command. Which means that I am going to... Try to, to divide and conquer, basically. Wow, I got loud there. I apologize. Uh, yeah, I'm going to try to divide and conquer, though. So... D this basically means focus heavily on on whatever is directly in front of us. Try to eliminate them, especially if they're weak, crappy ships. Uh, Your orders. 
once we kill the weak crappy ships. At your command. Change Destroy everybody else. So this is a weak crappy ship. Speaking we of weak crappy Navy. ships. I don't think you're going to be able to boost through this, but we'll try. You're also a weak crap, crappy ship, so we're going to have you drop fighters on him. You drop fighters on him. I want you to totally activate your your ability here. I want you both to also be at like 6k here. Right, you're totally going to take whatever that is. Activating tactical cogitators. So there goes that ship. Your orders. Um, are you still tactical cogitating? You are. Okay. Right, what are you doing? You're not tactical cogitating. Uh, you're about to. You're about to take the most well targeted. Um. What the fuck is it? Oh, you've been. You're about to get hit by the most well targeted which we call it of all time. I don't remember what I'm trying to say here, but I, I i mean, I know what I'm kind of trying to say. Understood. Come on, this, this, this guy's got to be close to death. Enemy ship sighted. Activating tactical cogitators. Helm coordinates acknowledged. There we go. Now we got some good shit going. Let's drop you on here. You should have been using that already. Let's drop you on here. Activating tactical cogitators. Ship ready. See, we can tactically cogitate you completely around, which would be completely Navy. useful because that should mean. See, now that's a weird thing to have happen there. Activating tactical cogitators. Oh, this, this guy just got killed, so that's good. Orders. The more of these that we Activated destroy, the better we will be at. Are you kidding me? Your orders? That is frustrating as fuck. It's mainly frustrating because this guy is the world's vessel. greatest fucking... Uh, user of... Of uh, the whatchamacallit ability, this thing. Okay, well, I finally got to use it well, so that's good. Now we're going to try to kill this thing. We're also going to heal, because we have the heal aboard. Ah, uh, you... Ah, oh, they all miss. That is really fucking frustrating. At least we hit there. We're gonna. Oh, you have one of these too, don't you? Gotta remember to do that. At your command. I think those got launched. Just. Oh no, they did hit. That's good. Is he warping out yet? Yes, Admiral. Not quite yet. We should be using uh, the reload ability, I think, here. Course plotted. Setting course. Yep, these guys I think will finish him off. What? You didn't finish him off? Well, he's warping out if he's not dead. He is dead. Okay, cool. I do want to launch these on you, and I do want to make a complete 180 Acquiring here. New vector. Course plotted. Beautiful. Launch those torps. Uh, you just took major damage, didn't you? That's too bad. Gotta be really good to destroy this thing. Activating tactical cogitators. Oh, and you're on fire with your engines damaged. Oh, that sucks. At your command. But this will pro okay, so he's dead now. That's good. Let's have you heal yourself, because you're not. There's no chance Enemy you're healing yourself sighted. anytime soon. How goes the battle over here? You're actually doing okay. I mean, it is a two-on-one, but this otherwise, you're doing okay. It'd be really good if I could 
Ship ready. Get a heal going here, but that doesn't look like it's going to happen anytime soon. I still have torps though, which is good. Come on, at least hit a few of those torps. We did. Your orders. You need to make a goddamn 180. Acquiring new vector. Cruising speed set. And then possibly I get closer here. Your orders. God damn, I wish you weren't about to die. Okay, good. We killed that guy. I did not. You turned in the complete wrong direction, but that's okay. Enemy ship sighted. So I want, I want you to start moving in on this guy, if possible. Now that's a problem. My ship is heavily damaged. I must retreat in order to save my crew. Acknowledge Please don't die. Good luck. Okay, so he made it out. That's good. Um, we're actually going to be command. sitting here sort of slow boating it for a minute. I am going to... Oh, I can't even orders. use that right now. That's too bad. Engines hot. Gonna heal though, which now. is good. Let's get at le least a few repairs Awaiting going. Orders. I actually want to move received. this way. Are you kidding me? God damn it. Yes, Admiral. Well, let's turn back. We want we want them to fly right through this, which it looks like he's going to. Plotted. It looks like he's setting, setting up. Course. To fly right through there. Activating tactical cogitators. Oh, that's a good shot. That is a good shot. Understood. Okay, so now he's turning away. Let's launch some torps. For the Emperor. Which we hit, and then we lost all our ships. Why aren't you actually engaging? Please, please engage. Yes, Admiral. This guy's lost his engines, which sucks. Engines to maximum. Because it means he won't basically ever be able to use his torps unless uh, they close range. Cruising speed set. No, you need to be. Closing range. Changing course. You basically need to be closing range. Always be closing here. Activating tactical cogitators. Engines hot. Yeah. Okay, let's launch the torps. Did I did I time that well? It looks like I timed that Okay. Not as well as I would have liked. Your orders? Oh, that's a bad shot. Setting course. That is a bad Reloading. shot, but we still have the reload ability, which we should be using Ship on ready. both ships. There goes his shields. Acquiring new vector. Yeah, get those guns shooting, set. and then let's turn around and see if we can get the front side guns, or the, the right yes, side guns remember. to shoot as well. Changing course. And where's the other ship? He's way the fuck over here, but still in range, which is good. Awaiting orders. Are you kidding me? You actually got a lightning strike in there. Ship okay. ready. All right. Ah, oh, you fucking kidding me! Right on me. His accuracy Underway. is ridiculous. Mine is not as accurate. Yep, you're definitely Engine taking spot. it up the butt. Setting course. Yep, start going after this guy, please. Engines hot. Ship ready. You'll have bombers to be able to use in a minute, so that's good at least. We yeah, are just, the just go after Navy. this guy. You go after him too. Looks like he's gonna fly right into there. 
surrender while Which you is can. Beautiful. We will completely obliterate what remains of your fleet. I will never surrender to you, Ravensburg, or even the dead emperor. My master will let the galaxy burn. Setting course. All right, cool. Launching some torps that he may be able to avoid. He looks like he's going to take one. Just too bad because it probably means that this ship is fucked. I'm not in a good position to use this skill. Execute high energy turn. God damn it. He's not going to fly into that. Do you have uh, dudes yet? You do not. Yes, we should be able to win this engagement. Course plotted. Yep, you're having a bad day. But at least you can drop uh, some fighter bombs on them. And I, I, I do want you to try to get the fuck out of here at this point. I'd prefer if you didn't die. Reloading. I don't know why I tactically cogitated there, but... Oh, he's turning. That's actually kind of good for us. Ah, he just activated his... Sh he just got his shields up. That's too bad. Your orders? We do want... ...to completely turn. We also want to heal while we have the opportunity. Oh, didn't get that one off either. I'm basically trying, if you're wondering, guys. I'm basically sort of... Oh, come on. At least get these bombers out. Resuming normal functions. All ahead full. Your orders? Changing course. Yeah, get our bombers out as well. Gonna raise our shields. At your command. And I think what I want to do. The first thing I want to do is drop you here. Activating then I want to jump literally right in front of you. Targeting enemy vessel. Understood. Nice torpedo hit. God damn, he got his shields up again right when I wanted to. Oh, you're still not running away. Oopsies. Now let's drop. Let's drop uh, more fighters on. Man, this is a long battle. It's gonna be like the one battle for the entire episode. Changing this course. is a major engagement. More fighters. There we go. Now we got him. You have my gratitude for extending your trust, human, and for dealing with the seditious captain. And he was seditious. Heretics must be purged from the Emperor's galaxy, even if they hide within our own ranks. All right, so, so not a bad victory. We managed to keep our other cruiser from uh, getting heavily damaged, which is really good. Um, this is just a good straight up battle, I think. I don't think there's enough time to do another battle, though. So this will be a short episode, guys. I apologize. My rangers are searching the wreckage of your traitor captain's ship. They tell me that they have found many disturbing signs of his corruption. This traitor turned the temple aboard his ship into a shrine of blood and carnage. Eldrathane, this is a matter for the Inquisition. Pull your warriors back at once. Inquisitional ships are already on their way, alien. You would do well to be gone when they arrive. Well done, Admiral Spire. Your diplomatic skill with the Eldar and exposure of the traitor have strengthened our chances of winning this war. All right, yeah, not bad. Anyway, we're going to end the episode here. So thank you guys very much for watching. I hope you've enjoyed it. I don't know which ep what, where we're going to battle our next battles. But with that all being said, I thank you very much for watching. And I will see you all next time.